Right, hi guys. Um, my name is Louis. It's me again here. If you've done some of my videos, you know me. Um, I'm here to show you another strength conditioning um, workout with the body weight. Okay, so that's for people who don't have any weight at home and want to try to keep active during this lockdown. Okay, so I'm going to go through the first round of exercises, okay? Um, and I'm going to show you the technique and a few options to make it a bit easier or to make it more challenging. We're going to do five exercises and each exercise we're going to do 40 seconds with a 20 second rest. So it's going to be a five minute round in total, okay? So come on, let's do this. So get yourself ready, yeah? The first exercise is a burpee, right? So what I want you to do, I want you to squat, put your hands down, get your feet back, get your feet forward where they were, and stand up, okay? You can also jump, or you can just step, step, jump forward, or step, 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 and stand up, okay? So these are your options for the burpee. 40 seconds, give me as many as you can, okay? So ready, set, and go. Right, so the squat, big back, forward, stand up. The whole way through, make sure your abdominal muscles are resting, very tight, Okay, remember the option to jump. You can also go whoop whoop. Give me a little whoop whoop as you're jumping. It helps get through the burpee a little bit quicker. Remember the option to step. As long as you're squatting deep, that's my main concern. Three, two, and one. Good. We got 20 seconds to rest. The next exercise is called the Renegade Row. Okay, so what we're gonna do is a plank, okay? So hands under the shoulders, shift your weight over your hands, feet wide, and you pull the way over towards the ceiling, okay? Ready, set, and go. Option here, put your knees on the floor to make it easier. As you do it, the biggest thing here, keep your abdominal muscles all braced as tight as possible. Your, your, butt, your butt muscles braced and really tight, okay? And you do the pulling, driving the elbow towards the ceiling. Squeezing the shoulder blades as you drive the elbow up. Come on. Three, two, and one. Good, so the next one is a tuck jump. So what I want you to do, just squat, jump, tuck your knees to the chest, okay? Option, squat and jump only, or you squat and get onto your toes. You don't want to have the impact. Ready, sit, and go. So get your hands up here, and aim to touch the hand on your knees. Land soft, push that bum back. This is a really powerful exercise. It requires a lot of core activity as well, as well as power, power from the glutes and control. Option, just jump, no duck, or, or do those. Three, two, and one. Relax, catch your breath. Next one is a push up. Okay, so get your hands wider than your shoulders. Right, put your knees on the floor, put your knees off the floor, get your chest between your hands, and push yourself up. Okay? Three, two, and one. Good. Remember your option there? It's the same position as the plank for the renegade row, okay? So squeeze the butt, raise the abs, move your body up and down as one unit, okay? Keep your elbows soft to the top. Three, two, 
Ten one. Good. And then the last exercise is a sit up. Okay, so what you want to do, right? Lie flat on the floor. Okay, go up, touch your knees, back down again. Option, if you can't do a sit up, just do a crunch, okay? It's fine. Three, two, and one. Great. Avoid, try to avoid flinging your arms, okay? Keep your hands by your head. Make sure the abdomen and muscles are in control of the movement. Oh yeah. Woo. We can do this, guys. You and me together. Oh yeah. 10 seconds to go. Three, two, and one. Right. Woo. Right, guys, so well done. So this is a whole set number one. So it's five minutes in total, okay? And if you um, have now a rest, so the beginner option is for you to actually do two or three rounds of this. So it's gonna give you about 12 to 18 minutes in total. Um, um, intermediate option will be somewhere between four and five sets. And if you're more advanced, what you can do is actually do five to seven rounds, okay? So this is gonna give you about 40 minutes of training, right? Uh, a couple of tips for you to do, okay? If you wanna push a bit harder, um, speed up, count the number of reps you're doing on each round and try to maintain the number of reps, okay? So if you do on your first round, if you did nine burpees, try to keep nine burpees for the next one and for the next one as well, same as the push-ups, okay? Uh, and this is gonna make sure you're not dropping the form and dropping the performance so much towards the end, okay? So you're gonna make sure you're pushing yourself and have a bit of a target to achieve, okay? So I hope you enjoyed the session, okay? If you, if you like the videos, just like the page, Follow me on Facebook, Luis Silva Training. Uh, also my YouTube channel, Luis Silva Training Hub. Um, and there's videos for you to get through lockdown, especially people who don't have any kit. Okay, so this is gonna this is especially designed for you to start easy and continue to progress and gain your fitness and become fitter and become more a, a bit stronger as well. Okay, so thank you very much. 